In this problem, we have Courtney, she runs 3.5 miles, so her total di distance is 3.5 miles. In the same amount of time, it takes Tammy to run 6 miles. Well, obviously one of them has to go faster than the other. So it says that Courtney ran, so Courtney ran 2 miles per hour slower. So if Tammy's rate is R, then this girl is 2 slower, so minus 2. You could also have this and it would also work. You could have Car Courtney be R, and then you could have Tammy, if she's too slower, then she's too faster. So you could also have this, and then you're going to set them equal. So either one will get you the same solution. Now we're going to set them equal because of this. We talked in the last example that there's this formula, distance equals rate times time. So if we plug in that Courtney is 3.5, goes a distance of 3.5, and her rate is too slower than Tammy's, that if we divide by r minus 2, we have an equation for the time. Now over here, if we divide by r, we have 6 over r equals t. So because they both equal time, when you take the distance divided by the rate equals the time it takes, that's why we could just take this and set it equal to this. That's why this works right here. So the next thing is we need to solve this. So you could do this. You could do cross products like that. Or the other way you can do it is finding a common denominator. So the common denominator would be r and r minus 2. So whatever we do to one side, we have to do to this side. So we have to multiply both sides by r times r minus 2. So when we do that, this crosses out, divides out with this. So we're left with r times 3.5. Then over here, this r cancels out with this r, and we're left with 6 and r minus 2. So now we're going to go ahead and solve that equation. So we're going to go ahead and distribute. 6 times r is 6r. 6 times negative 2 is negative 12. And then we're going to subtract 6r to put all the r's on the left side. And divide by... negative 3.5 and we get r equals alright I just noticed I had a mistake right here 3.5 right here minus 6 did that in my head incorrectly that should be 2.5 so instead of dividing by 3.5 we're dividing by negative 2.5 So r equals, so we're going to take our calculator and do negative 12 divided by negative 2.5 is 4.8. Okay, so we got r equals 4.8. That's really slow. Well, we're talking about people running. So r, what we got, the r of 4.8 R is Tammy's running speed, whereas Courtney's 2 miles per hour slower. So 4.8 minus 2 is 2.8. So Courtney runs at 2.8 miles per hour and Tammy runs at 4.8. So Courtney runs at a speed of 2.8 miles per hour and Tammy runs at a speed of 4.8 miles per hour.